The next one is from um, from Booker Fritz. Hey, Lars, uh, I'm in a pretty bad spot right now. Ooh, that sucks. Um, I have designed a fishing lure and had it 3D printed multiple times. I just went to make a final change to my CAD file and the hard drive crashed. Isn't that the worst? Uh, I'm starting a new business based off this fishing lure design. So I'm kind of freaking out. I don't blame you, man. Um, I know very little about all this. So do I <laughs> only learn what I need to know about my design lure. So I do have an STL file backed off of the lure on my flash drive. And I thought that was a good idea, um, but it's an STL. I tried editing it and turning it into a part, but it has 1,368,234 facets. Whew. Uh, I have no idea what to do. I need to get this part back and keep it original form. Can you help? I hope so. So you need to reply back to me. But unless, let's come into uh, back into Fusion here. Um, unless that you were in the, I would, <laughs> let me open up a new file here. Unless that you did run working offline, you should still hopefully have a copy of the fishing lure up in the cloud. Um, you can change how often um, you're backing things up on your hard drive. Um, in your preferences here how to keep how many days to keep your files on your hard drive but if you don't if you are working online as most of us are hopefully it is still on your in your file system in here now the first thing I want you to do Booker is I want you to go up here and click on the arrow to go back to your main directory okay main directory and hopefully it's stored in here somewhere go all the way up to the top and up here there's one called recent data double click on that and i hope i pray for you that you find your fishing lure sitting in here up on the cloud because as you can see um there is a lot of stuff in your recent file up there so, Booker, I hope that I stopped right here and you're saying, oh, thank goodness. There it is, man. And you are all set. Um, so so that's what I hope for because, and I've said this before, and, and 3D printer people don't like me for saying this, but I'm not a big fan of STL files. Why am I not a big fan of STL files? Because STL files are just these facets of faces and there's a million of them and it's just a shell. There's no intelligence in it. Um, and whatever those facets are that is not smooth, uh, that's what they are. So when you have this, this option right now, all I could think about is to pretty much, you can, you can reduce your facet count down to something less, um, and then bring it in and maybe kind of start redoing your work. Um, but I really hope for you that if you go up and click on recent, that that's where you will find it sitting in there. Open it up, save it wherever you need it, and hopefully you're all set. That's what I hope for you, man. Let me know. Send me an email. I'm curious. Or leave a comment or something like that. This was useful. That recent data is actually is, is a saver many times. But this is one of the reasons to work, you know, where you're working on the cloud, is that if your hard drive dies, then, you know, you, you have a backup.